What's up guys, this is iTweaks here, and today I'm going to be showing you something pretty exciting, and that is a newly updated type status. Now if you guys aren't familiar with type status, basically what it allows you to do is receive a banner notification right up here, actually in the status bar, not really a banner notification, it overlays the status bar, and it tells you when someone is typing to you in iMessage, it even tells you the person's name that's typing to you in this newly updated version. So you can see here if we jump into the settings and you can see we're already in type status settings here. Right up here at the top you have the status bar icon. So if you want to toggle that on then you can. Then this is going to turn off the actual overlay which I have on right now. Now I'll show you that in just a second. You also have the overlay toggle right here and you have the hide text after delay. So after a specific amount of time if you want to hide the uh, typing status up here then you can do so by keeping this toggled on now here we have hide inside messages so you're not actually going to get that status bar overlay inside of messages so here you have a little test typing uh, button right here so if you type that you can see you're getting a text message from John Appleseed right there now if we toggle this on it's going to automatically turn off the status bar overlay and it's going to give you a status bar icon right up here when someone starts typing to you so you can see right there you get that little indicator now the thing about this is is that it actually doesn't go away it stays up there and it actually hasn't gone away ever since I tested this and the only way I could get it to go away was actually respringing my device so that is something to keep in mind I personally like the status bar overlay just because I think that looks a little bit better as well as it tells you exactly who is typing to you. So if we scroll down here you also have your red status bar overlay. So if they read your text message and they have that option set where you can actually see when they've read a message then you're going to see that right up there in the status bar. You also have hide this in messages so you can toggle that on as well which I recommend and you can see exactly what that looks like. You just get a little check mark, red, and who read your message. Now down here you can actually set the overlay display duration. So if you only want it to be five seconds then you can leave it right there, but you can just tap on this and it's going to obviously either increase or decrease the delay. So you can see right here, it's just gonna show up for just a second and then go away. Now down here you have your overlay animation. So you can have it fade, which is what I have right now, or you could have it on slide, and I'll show you what that looks like. So you see it just slides down from the top and slides right back up. You have both of these toggled on and you can see that it basically just takes over the slide animation, not much fade. Now just to show you this is actually does work, if we go to the springboard here and I just start to type uh, a message to myself, you can see that I'm getting a text message right there. So just to show you if we go into the messages app and we open up one of these messages, you can see here if I start to type. I get the little GIF down here, but I'm not getting the type status indicator right up here in the status bar because I have it toggled off. So a really cool tweak. This is very simple, but it's something that I always use on my jailbroken devices. I'm really excited that they actually did just update this. Again, you will have to actually add a repo, and I'll put that in the description below as well as a link right on the video. So let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Also, don't forget to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter for updates. And if you haven't checked out my gaming channel, then go over there and stop by and say hey. Alright guys, until next time, peace.